Yeah. Questions for Lee? Oh. Well, we just uh, first week of camp. You just had your first scrimmage on Saturday, which or on Sunday actually. What are kind of your early evaluations, and how did that first scrimmage go? Uh, it went pretty well. Just keep uh, being disciplined, working on the things you need to work on, and uh, improve every day. Be consistent, and just keep getting in shape, better shape. And Lee, um, how's the the line been physic physically wise? I mean, physicality wise, do you, do you guys feel like you guys are doing a good job of that, like getting uh, getting out and after the quarterback? Oh, it's all right, Joe. Like every day, you always can uh, attack the field with a mindset to get better. So every day, we just want to improve and get better. So every day, I feel we do, we're doing all right, so we can do better day by day. Justin mentioned that you played really well. It was kind of the standout performance of the, of the scrimmage. I want to ask about Caven Paul. What maybe he's brought to that to that mix on the end? Uh, Caven is Caven. Uh, I really uh, not in defense in room, but he do his job and he do his responsibility. And, he big on being coachable. What have you noticed from the offensive line uh, that's different than years past um, going against them in uh, practice? Uh, what I've noticed this year, they just a bit heavier, uh, more physical, more stronger, more faster, uh, play good together. So that's a great thing. That's a plus. Uh, they help me get better day by day. So appreciate them boys for coming out, being big, <laughs> wide, strong, and fast, and helping me. Who's one of them that stands out as someone that gets you better? I ain't just gonna point out and say one. I feel like all them boys get better because they work together. Lee, now that you've been here a while, you're a statesman uh, amongst the defensive line and the defense in general. What's your favorite piece of advice you give one of your teammates here in this offseason to get better to enter 2024? Can I hear that question again, please? What's your favorite piece of advice you're giving one of your teammates to get better heading into 2024 in the offseason? One piece of advice I can give my teammate is uh, just keep working, work, work, work. Like uh, every time a guy come that, that been to the next level who talked to our team, only thing they push out and say is, is work. So advice I can learn from people who been at the level that we're trying to reach is they tell us work. So when I give out advice, I just try to work myself and tell them to do the same thing as work. Well, I gotta ask you. You mentioned people talking to you. Who's who's the favorite person who's spoken to you that you kind of model that way? Uh, probably Noble. Probably Noble. Just the the, the success he uh, reached and uh, and what he accomplished in life. So I just say him and the wisdom that he gave back to us. Okay. Lee Gus mentioned that he was gonna make this fall camp a little. A little tougher on you guys. Has it, has it felt that way so far after the first week? Oh yeah, it's tough. You you come in, you have a hundred and twenty-two play scrimmage, so that that tell it all. <laughs> what were some of looking back on Sunday scrimmage? What were some of the top plays you remember that you guys had on on, on, on defense? Uh, top plays we had. I probably say every play that a teammate made on defense that was behind the lines, that was running to the ball like the Elford. Like you can you can make a good play just by getting Elford. So just by just by effort, effort, effort. You remember any like sacks that guys had, or TFLs, or interceptions, or? Not really, not really. It's it's year three for you with uh, Coach Martin. How has he helped you uh, grow as both a man and as a football player? Oh, uh, Coach Martin, Coach Martin. We had our ups and downs, but Coach Martin, a uh, great coach, great guy. Uh, and when I have a situation like, if I have a situation, Coach Martin probably look at me and tell just by my demeanor. So. Co Martin always be there for me, like truly, like real, like. So I appreciate Co Martin and what he do for me and, and, and everything we went through. And he come out every day and coached me the hardest. So appreciate Coach Martin and, and the love that he showed and, and give me day by day. And speaking to a number of the defensive players, aggression or aggressiveness has kind of been the word that's been used to describe this new scheme under Coach Roof. So how would you say you guys are demonstrating aggressiveness and within the confines of this new scheme? Uh, putting your hands on somebody, hard hits, tackling, doing your job the best way you want to do it, and, and just playing physical. Like be strong. Like do hard, go all out with it. Don't don't have step it, cause you have step some. That's that's when physicality go away. When you have doing it, when you being lazy and don't feel like doing it. When you come out the mindset on that practice field and you say I want to do something, that when your physicality is gonna come. It's just like a natural instinct. What are a few words to describe this defense? Uh, TFT, tough, fast, tough. <laughs> All right, thank you. Appreciate y'all.